what is up everybody welcome back to the big shot show in today's video we are going to be covering the valorous hero event in pokemon go um it is the final hero event that is going to be happening it's about a week long uh, i'm a little late but a uh, little late is better than never right or you know however that old saying goes uh anyway it's going to be uh it's going to be the team valor event which is why i wore red for this particular video uh, I know I didn't have a instinct one. That's not because I have any beef with instinct. Uh, that is literally because my power was going out and the video got all corrupted as I was editing it. And the event was over before I was able to re-record it, basically. Uh, but that's neither here nor there. With this one, we'll be checking out uh, what is coming up, or I guess what is currently happening in the Valorous Hero event. Um, it's, you know, it's a little miniature week-long event um it's got another exclusive pokemon this time being a ponita with a band and uh some some bonuses in the game but without further ado let's get cracking shall we all right so trainers help out candela during the upcoming valorous hero event again like i said it's already live but i wanted to get this out before it ends because i'm trying to do good here um, as we see, there's a Ponita, so not necessarily a band, but kind of like a necklace, kind of in the shape of a, uh, a certain legendary bird, maybe. And if we go through this, trainers, when a friend needs a hero, will you rise to the occasion? Um, I will point out that Candela answering the thing uh, is pretty obnoxious, just because, <gasps> sigh, blah, 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 <gasps> sigh, blah, blah, blah. Like, she she sighs a lot during the 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 timed research reading or whatever candela may be a strong trainer but the team valor leader could use some uh, research support get ready to enjoy an all-new event focused on powering up and battling pokemon a valor's hero mega pincer will also make its pokemon go debut in mega raids also for the first time in pokemon go you'll be able to encounter shiny tapu fini uh, if you're lucky of course so a valor's hero event uh, we'll be running from a Thursday, May 11th, 2023 at 11 a.m. your local time. Again, that's already been like the day past. To Wednesday, May 17th, 2023 at 8 p.m. your local time. Always your local time because, you know, that's where you're playing the game. So right here we see we have the Mega Pincer debut with a chance of being shiny. So that is cool. Um, especially just not having it be shiny locked for its Mega Unlock. You know, it's just the game has had a lot of a lot of trouble lately. So anything that is like a little win i'll take because we need all the little wins we can get the event bonuses will include two times candy for catching pokemon trainers level 31 and above will have a greater chance of getting candy xl uh, up to two free raid passes from spinning photo discs at gyms and two times mysterious components from team go rocket grunts which will just help you battle leaders a lot more frequently and uh, then you can stockpile your 12k eggs and you know the the 12k exclusive pokemon so that's cool raids will be as follows for the one star raids we have galarian ponita and hoot hoot both with the chance of being shiny we also have his sweet and growlith three star raids we will have galarian sidefisk Druridagon, his sweet and braviary and his sweet and avalug all with the chance of being shiny so that's nice and then five star again tapu fini with his shiny release so that's nice and then the mega raids mega pincer Again, always remember that when it comes to Omega, you only have to Omega Evolve one time, and then walking with any of the other Pokemon in that family will also earn you Mega Energy so that you can Mega Evolve again in the future, or you can wait for the cooldown to stop, and then you can Mega Evolve for free again. But it does cost you that initial Mega Evolution. Uh, so some more stuff here. Special Research Story, a Valorous Hero. So special research is the research that won't actually get deleted after it goes up, after the event is up. So you can just start it during the event and then you can, you know, take your time on it. Uh, I kind of freaked out during the instinctive one because I started it and um, then I was like trying to grind that last day and be like, oh, let me get this. And then the event was over. It wasn't I woke up the next morning because I didn't even think about it. I woke up the next morning and I was like, oh man, I missed out. And then I was actually still able to catch my exclusive Ella kid with the wristband. So that was nice. So same thing here for this, uh, this Ponita, which does have a chance of being shiny and is wearing a Candela themed accessory. This little neck piece again, that piece kind of looks like Moltres. There we go. Time research. There will also be time research that will be rewarding fast and charged teams during the event. 
So that's kind of nice just because you can use those. Uh, I'd personally save up on my charge TMs until there is a Team Go Rocket event. And then I burn through all of those uh, TMing away frustration on whichever Shadow Pokemon I have. Field Research Task Encounters. There are event-themed Field Research Task Encounters that will give you Stardust, Revives, Hyper Potions, and an encounter with a Ponita. So that's for the Special Research. Again, that will expire at the end of the event. But the but this one for the one wearing the uh, accessory won't expire. That one's special. This was the time. So it's it is what it is. <laughs> uh, and then also a reminder special seasonal special research and everyday hero. So there is still the reminder of the event whole season long um, everyday hero special research that is going on right now. Um, you can collect that until June 1st at 10 a.m. your local time. So even if you don't log into the game or you don't play a whole lot during this month, as we are kind of noticing a dip in players and playtime and just all around everything, especially with summer coming up, people want to go out and do things a little bit more. All those fun summertime activities that you haven't been able to do for the last like six, seven, eight months, you know? So even if you don't finish this, you will have a chance to start it up until June 1st. And then after that, this one will go away and we'll be in the next season. So uh, plan accordingly. And with that, that will be my quick review of the Valorous Hero event in Pokemon Go. Um, I know we're having some difficulties in Pokemon Go as a whole right now. Um, mainly, you know, coming to things around like the remote raid passes and, and all sorts of other stuff. I don't want to really dive into that in this video. But I hope if you are playing and you're still enjoying the game, that you can enjoy this little miniature event. Hopefully you get everything that you want. I mean, there's not really any new Pokemon being introduced. I guess you can get um, your Mega Pinsir or your Ponita, and I hope that it is good for you, the, the Ponita wearing the accessory. I hope that you're happy with it, whatever it's IVs or if it's shiny, whatever, what have you. Uh, that'd be awesome. Uh, but yeah, so feel free to leave a like, subscribe, ring the bell down below. Uh, I appreciate all of the help and the support that you guys give to this channel, so thank you, thank you. And without further ado, remember... No matter wherever you are, have a good day, good night, and a good morning. And as always, a good shower. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. -a!